Once upon a time, in a kingdom not so far away, there lived a young woman named Cinderella. She was tired of sweeping floors, dealing with wicked stepsisters, and dreaming about glass slippers. So, one day, she decided to take matters into her own hands and join Tinder. Swipe right for magic, Cinderella created her profile, using her best pumpkin-filtered selfie. Her bio read, Lost my shoe at a royal ball. Looking for someone who can handle my midnight curfew. As she swiped through profiles, she came across a charming guy named Charming. His profile picture showed him riding a white horse, with a castle in the background. His bio said, Prince seeking princess, must love glass slippers and dancing under moonlight. Cinderella hesitated, should I swipe right? After all, she hadn't even met Prince Charming yet. But then she thought, why not? It's not like I'm getting any younger. A match made in Fairyland. To her surprise, Charming swiped right too. They matched instantly. Their chat began with cheesy pickup lines. Charming, are you a fairy godmother? Because you just granted my wish. Cinderella, is your name Prince Charming? Because I think I just found my happily ever after. They laughed, shared stories, and bonded over their love for magical creatures. Charming confessed that he secretly hated glass slippers, they were terrible for horseback riding. Cinderella admitted that she preferred sneakers to glass shoes any day. The Midnight Dilemma As their connection deepened, Cinderella faced a dilemma. She had a date with Prince Charming at the Royal Ball, but she'd already fallen for Charming from Tinder. What was a girl to do? She confided in her fairy godmother, who said, Cindy, darling, follow your heart. But don't forget the curfew. The Royal Ball, the night of the ball arrived. Cinderella wore her sparkliest gown, her hair styled like a Pinterest princess. She met Prince Charming, who looked dashing in his royal attire. They danced, twirled, and exchanged pleasantries. But when the clock struck midnight, Cinderella panicked. She excused herself, leaving behind her glass slipper. As she dashed down the palace stairs, she realized she'd forgotten her phone. She needed to message Charming. Tinder to the rescue, Cinderella sprinted back to her room, grabbed her phone, and opened Tinder. She messaged Charming. Cinderella. Hey, sorry about the abrupt exit. I'm the girl who left the glass slipper. But honestly, I've already found my match on Tinder. Let's meet at the Enchanted Coffee Shop tomorrow? Charming replied instantly. Charming. I knew it. I've been chatting with you. Enchanted Coffee Shop it is. Happily ever after, swipe right. And so, Cinderella and Charming met at the cozy coffee shop. They laughed about their royal ball mishaps, shared pumpkin spice lattes, and discovered that love could be found both in fairy tales and dating apps. As for Prince Charming, he eventually found his princess, she was a dragon tamer who loved adventure. They all became friends and threw epic double date parties in the enchanted forest. And so, in this modern twist of fate, Cinderella swiped right on love, danced with her Tinder match, and lived happily ever after, no glass slippers required. The End